squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Will you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig, once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terrence. Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terrence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh, jeez, I think that was us. So, you're doing this all as a way to bring back your dead son? Bring him back? Well, of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These? Horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck would you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. Problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Freedom Pals. What are you doing, fat ass? So, you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Pal? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go on, talk. Guys? Guys, it's me, the kid. Will you knock it off? Listen to me. Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage. He's an animal. Ah! That's enough out of you, Kieran. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. So long, Freedom Pal. Sorry, kids, but we're probably all going to die here. Those kitties look kind of cute, but they're not. Yep, this calls for call girls. This one will definitely make the door open. Uh-oh, here's I've released more test subjects. Watch out for their claws and butts. I could use a band-aid or ten. We got a cat on an attack vector.
I assume you've all had your TDAP vaccination. I really should make that a requirement for the tour. Yes, hasten their journey to the hereafter. These things are so biting and scratchy. Honing in on the signal. Oh, yeah, yeah, that might have messed up the other generator. No, oh, no weakness. I'm not your worst nightmare. I aspire to be. Mysterion, you're a beast. Well, you know, I have been working out. None of these really scream door. Oh, shoot. Well, we'll look back at this and laugh if we live, which we won't. Meow. Oops, I think I just did something bad to the generator. three times and it did three different things.
those who oppose freedom, pals. I'm hogging the action. I'm up. Now the cooling system's down. I didn't know I had a button that did that. It's my turn to get fresh. Amazing. Your single asses beat their many asses. It just doesn't add up. My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children. You know, I'm not sure this panel actually opens the door at all. Mutant sixth graders are on the loose. This was definitely not supposed to happen. Ugh, school's so dumb. Parents are dumb. Yeah, adults are stupid. Oh, Jesus. It's okay. We'll be safe in the tour tram. Oh, the tour tram is offline. Somebody's gonna have to get to the CPU and hit the override switch. Where's the CPU? Down on the third level. Oh, it was silly to put it there, wasn't it? So somebody has to walk down to the third level and flip the switch? One, two, three, not it. Not it. Not, not it. it. Not it. Not it. Not it. Not it. <laughs> not it. Sorry, new kid, but it really should be you anyway. Yeah, if you think about it, this is all kind of your fault. Arr, school is dumb. noise I honestly couldn't tell you so what do we do now <laughs> Always right for the job. Good. We did it. I put the stairs behind that portal door, but to open the door, you're going to need power. The whole point of stairs is not to need electricity. Get that generator powered up, and the access to the stairs will open.
That's it. Now you can act. Okay, you should be coming to my dead son now. Just keep heading west. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at the little fourthy. Jasper, get over here, dude. There's a picture of some boobs, man. Boobs? I want to see some boobs. Where? Yeah, you better move that ass. Oh man, poor animals with all their extra butts. Come here, twerp. Stupid little fourthies. <laughs> if nothing else, beating on you guys is really therapeutic for me. Weep not for thine enemies. They're like total assholes. Let's pound these pussies. Now and needing to punch you was one of them. Call girl is making a house call. Check this out. You're gonna have to move after what I just did to you. That's how we do it in the sixth grade, you little shit. I'll wipe my asses with you, Fourthies. School is for homies. You ready for a flash mob? Because I am. You fourthies think you're smart because you go to school! 
Be victorious! Did somebody ping me? You're gonna hate me for this. should be right through that door, kid. We'll come down and join you. Kid, thank God! You've got to stop him! He's out of his mind! Cartman, you fucking asshole! What are you doing? Connor brought me here, human cat. The sick son of a bitch. Uh, you shut up, Coon. Soon this town will be rid of you and all the Coon friends. We're freedom pals, fat ass. We know what you're doing, Eric. Putting cat urine into people's drugs and alcohol to make them crazy. We want to know why. Yeah, why, you sick piece of... Uh, do I really have to spell it out, Coon? This city is sick. We both know it. There's only one time of year when this town is the way it should be. On Christmas! So I joined the Chamber of Commerce, and used them to unleash my master plan. Escalate crime in the city, blame crime on mayor, run for mayor, get tons of followers, clone new kid into a genetic mutant, win election, make everyday Christmas. What do you think? Pretty sweet plan, right? Dude, quick! Take a selfie! <laughs> it's almost a shame that no one will ever know how perfectly my plan worked. Dude, you've gone too far this time. Nobody's gonna let you be mayor. Oh, no? I've got all the new kids' followers. Every last one of them is now following me. Gee, that was smart. Eric, I know that Christmas every day sounds like fun, but it really wouldn't be. Fuck you, Dr. Timothy. If you guys don't mind, I've got an election to win. <laughs> God damn it! Well, there goes the main CPU. Darn it, why did I put that thing on a mobilized trap door? Why wouldn't you? I'm afraid now someone will have to go clear to the ground level and call for the tour tram from there. All right, fine. Hurry up, new kid. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, new kid. Stop wasting time. Come here, little minion. There you go. 
fulfilled my duty, and now I must depart. Oh, looks like all the mutated animals have broken loose. Welp. Looks like you've run into mutant sixth graders. Oh, and they look hungry. Don't get eaten. people from below. Get ready for the call girl haters. Soundproofing the walls in here so that no one could hear screams was not cheap, let me tell you. I'm going through a lot of stuff right now and needing to punch you as one of them. I took you to school, Forthy. I hate school. I'll crush you, twerps. Take that, Forthy. Hungry eyes. That's how we do it in the sixth grade, you little shit. Stupid. 